Hello fellow Whovians and welcome to Mr. Who Reviews. For today I'll be reviewing Doctor Who Season 8 Episode 6 The Caretaker. In today's episode the Doctor pretends to be a temporary caretaker for a Clara's school because there's a dangerous alien robot on the loose and he's trying to get it back to his own planet. And he finally meets Clara's boyfriend, Danny Pink. This episode was written by Guy Roberts and Stephen Moffat. Now, last time I said the trailer seemed a bit sitcom commy. Sitcomish, I don't know words. Yeah, make sitcom. But it, it kind of seems like it is. Would seem like that. Since Sky Roberts also wrote the the Lodger and Closing Time, two episodes are kind of comi com comical. This not so much. The how many years? Sort of like I can't believe this they put in here so stupid. One laughing. But there was one part that was a bit laughable, that was funny, is when the doctor is on in a win up on a window where Clara is teasing her class while they're reading a season about prime prizes while they're reading it. Well, and the doctor said that's been on the wrong year on the board and she thinks there's he doesn't do somebody or something. I wrote but it turned out that he just looked at the copyright page and see what year it was or back page or whatever. Now the acting in, in this is good. I don't think anybody was actually that bad in it. Peter Capaldi is just great in this. Like you actually see the anger in his face. But you can feel it sometimes. And the scenes between him and Danny Pink are just fantastic. At one point, when Claire tries to lie to Danny again, when he finds out who the Doctor is. And when Danny thinks that the Doctor is Claire's dad. How? I don't know how. Maybe. Uncle or something but that Ugh. My favorite part has to be when he uh, tends to be a soldier and call and calls doctor an officer. They just like, great and yelling the doctor did. They don't see that was yelling from Now the doctor being human isn't really a new thing. David Tennant's done it. Matt Smith done it. But I think David Tennant would 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 have been the most ex like the most per most person that do it right. I'm not counting the two part with the family of blood because he was turned into him when like being one. I think he was just more convincing. Matt Smith was. A little bit convincing, but uh, some does some weird. The A ten was kind of weird, but he seemed normal at the same time. Like could be an ordinary person, like. Uh, let's see what else. Oh yeah, the invisible watch. That's a cool thing. Why don't we have that nowadays? I'll give this episode a uh, 6 out of 10. Now, it's going to be next episode is going to when October starts. Because it seems like a good episode to, for the month. It's just very, very creepy. See you later.